There you go. Oh my god. That's a cool rock. Hey, this is the LaRose Bros. And today, we're here at Edmunds Pier, and we're going to be doing some fishing. We have our pole set up with bait fishing rigs, so we can catch some bait fish like shiner or herring. And after we catch uh, bait fish, we're going to be doing some bottom fishing uh, with the fish we catch. And after it gets sunset, we're going to be doing some squidding as well. Yeah, so we got our sabiki set up. We're going to have some squid jigs ready and our spotlight out in the water so that by the time it gets dark, we can start our squidding and see if we can catch any squid. We'll probably catch some bait fish. So we're gonna see if we can have any luck here today on Emmons Pier. So I'm using a shiner that Phoebe caught as bait and also some sandworms. Uh, I'm trying to do some bottom fishing so we'll see what I can catch. Uh, there's a lot of things that you can catch while bottom fishing like ratfish, rockfish, uh, lean cod, all kinds of stuff. Maybe even some flounder. Keep reeling. It's a really heavy one. Whoa. Oh my gosh, I caught my first ever rockfish. <laughs> This is your this is your lucky day, Phoebe. Oh my gosh. That's not the one that's Phoebe, hold your Here's a rockfish. Phoebe has some. Are those shiners? Yeah. Oh, what kind of shiners? Speak up, baby. So what you think? I caught some shiners that put all the people hair in. Oh, well. Oh, hey, shiners. Oh, I got a fish. No, maybe not. Yeah, I don't. I'll just... What? Is this something huge? Like a seal or something? I don't know what this is, but it feels huge. And right now it's not fighting, so, but earlier it was fighting a whole lot. Oh geez, it's fighting now again. I wonder if this is a salmon or something. It could be salmon, yeah. Here we go. Oh my gosh, it's a big rock fish. Oh my gosh. Whoa, that's huge. That's a huge rockfish. There's seaweed on there too, so the weight makes sense. Oh my gosh, it's huge. That's an enormous rockfish. This thing is enormous. Oh, biggest rockfish I've ever this seen. This is an enormous rockfish. I'm gonna release it so I can survive here, hold my mask. This looks like a copper rockfish. And here we go. Enormous yeah, rockfish. That's, that's an I'm enormous gonna copper it. rockfish. Never seen one that big in person. Yeah, he took the entire shiner I had on there. The entire shiner. So uh, a big, a uh, big, a uh, lot of bait uh, yeah. equals a big rockfish. So, we got like the shiner we just caught today. It's super fresh. It probably smelled really stinky. So that giant rockfish, it was either a quillback or a copper rockfish, never seen one that big, went after the whole shiner. So pretty big fish. The seaweed explains the weight besides the big fat rockfish. So Yeah, that's probably my personal best uh, off of Edmunds Pier. Uh, really big rockfish. Uh, I'm really excited to catch that big fish. Uh, it was a pretty hard fight actually. It uh, took me a while to get it off of the bottom. So Yeah, that's pretty cool. So we'll keep fishing. Yeah, so I'm really glad about catching that uh, rockfish. It was a really fun fight. 
uh, I was using the shiner that Phoebe caught, so uh, really big bait uh, to catch a really big fish. Uh, I usually only use sandworms, but this is the first time I've actually used shiners here at Edmonds Pier. So uh, apparently the rockfish uh, like shiners, so uh, that's something to keep in mind when you're fishing here. Uh, I assume that herring would also work to catch rockfish. And yeah, I'm just uh, really happy that I was able to catch that fish. That's a cool rockfish. Kind of dinky little rockfish. That looks Not like as big a... as Silas is, but it's still a rockfish. Bye bye, go swimming. As you could, probably could have told, oh, mom, your line's going off. What kind of rockfish do you think that was? Yeah, uh, as you could see, mine was uh, an orange rockfish, so it was probably a copper rockfish. Uh, it might have been a weird colored quillback rockfish or a brown rockfish, but um, most likely it was a copper rockfish. The rockfish uh, that our dad caught, though, looked more like a black rockfish or a deacon rockfish. Yeah, probably. Or maybe even a widow rockfish. I would think that was a black rockfish. It had a pretty dark coloring. I got another shiner. This one is tiny. I got another one. Here's another shiner. Um, I'm using, I'm using a sabiki with little sandworm pieces on it. So, yeah, we're catching lots of bait fish. Sauce is trying bottom fishing before it, the sun sets. We're throwing all of these um, rockfish back Nothing because rocking. here at Edmonds Pier, oh, you um, you can't. Oh, mine is doing something. Here at Edmonds Pier, you can't keep rockfish, so that's why we're throwing them all back. The big one that Silas caught, we had to throw back because you just can't keep them here. So if you're at Edmonds Pier, keep that in mind. You can't keep rockfish, but um, most other places you can. Here you can't though. You'll wanna always make sure that you can keep the fish um, before you keep it, just in case you can't. You having fun? Yeah. I got one. Here it is. There goes your shiner. It's another rockfish. Another rockfish. We can't keep one. Well, that one has spots. This one's a pretty cool rockfish. It has spots and weird coloring, stripy. Yeah. That's a cool rockfish. I wonder what kind that is, do you know? Yeah. Uh, I don't know, but it went after the shiner, so sh apparently shiners are really good. Uh, bait for catching these rockfish. I'm gonna go ahead and release him. Uh, caught a dinky little rockfish, looks like, so we'll let him go. This is my squid jig that I prepared. I have this weighted one on the bottom. This one's not very weighted, it's on the top. We have a preparing for the squidding season video already posted, so you can check that out. Somebody is just Somebody just caught some, but I'm just gonna charge it with my black light here. And um, with the black light, you don't really have to do much. It takes um, maybe 10 seconds and they are glowing. So as you can see, that one on the left is already glowing a lot. So I'm gonna just charge these and start squidding. Somebody's already caught a squid. Sun is setting, time to squid. As you can see, the sun has set, so it's really dark out. We have our spotlight in the water. As I showed you, I charged my squid, so squid jigs, so um, I'm going to see if I can catch any squid. I haven't gotten any bites yet, but Sal saw, thought he saw a squid in the water, but it's pretty early in the season still. Uh, kind of, I was kind of deep, I got this herring, so it's kind of weird. You haven't got a single herring. Yeah, it's too small. The squid are coming slow this season, but we still had a great time catching Shiner and Rockfish at Edmonds Pier. As always, make sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.